There is a very good line that you should work for at least two hours a day for the two most important people. One for yourself and the other for the person you want to become. If you don't value time today, then days will pass by saying tomorrow, tomorrow. Months and years will pass and the day will also come when you will only regret that you have ruined your life. There is only one life. Whatever has to be done has to be done in this life. Think at the age of 50 when things will not go according to you, then how much you will regret that you could not do what you could have done. Whatever you are going to do with your time right now will decide where you are going to reach in the next five years. Everyone thinks that I will do this, I will do that, but who really does great work? Only that person who understands the value of time and time. I'm going to tell you 10 such effective methods and hacks which are used by highly successful people, leaders, writers. After watching this video, you will stop wasting time. This video will open your mind, my brother. At the end of the video, I will tell you the four most powerful methods which will make you 10 times productive. That's why watch the video. Don't skip. Let's start the video. Point number one. The first step to save time is to have a clear goal. You must have a clear goal. When earlier we used to hear that son get up early and you will get three hours extra. We used to think, brother friend, why do we have to get up early in the morning? What do we have to do after getting up? Why do we get up in the morning? We did not know what to do in life. What do we do with the time? That is why I have a clear goal. You have to have a long-term goal and plan your whole day keeping that in mind. If there is no clear goal, then days will keep passing, but there will never be clarity on where to spend the time. Point number two, make a daily goal. Before going to sleep at night, you should know what is the first thing to do as soon as you wake up in the morning. Before going to sleep at night, prepare a to-do list for the next day that what is to be done the whole day tomorrow. If you wake up in the morning without planning anything, then you will not be able to do anything. As soon as you wake up in the morning, you will start postponing the work in your mind. That friend, I will do it after some time. Let me eat food now. I will do it later. I am feeling sleepy after eating food. I will do it later. Then we think that friend, the whole day has been ruined. Let's let it be today. Tomorrow I will definitely start from the morning itself. And then we all know what happens tomorrow. So do not wake up without any goal on any day. Otherwise the whole day will be ruined. Write three goals on the top of your to-do list, which are the most important. You have to complete them at any cost. Then write the rest of the goals below them. Point number three. Push yourself all the highly successful people write daily goals and complete them. An average person listens to his heart. We do whatever comes to our mind. But a successful person does not follow his heart. The timetable is a slave of its schedule. That is why it is never able to waste any time. But we are scared of writing goals that I cannot work so hard. I cannot live such a strict life. Our old beliefs get hurt. But from today, we will have to decide. Write daily goals, accomplish them, push your limits, my brother. Be punctual. Make a schedule for the whole day from eating to sleeping and follow it. If you do not want to settle, then you will have to push yourself, my brother. You will have to come out of your comfort zone. And how that will happen is for that. Point number four. Start thinking about your future self. The best way to go out of the comfort zone is to think about the future self. Fear of the future. Whether my dreams will be fulfilled or not. Will I end up being average? Ask yourself today. Ask yourself, how can I change my future? How can I achieve all those things that I want to achieve? Then the same voice will come from within that work hard now. There is a quote that your future depends on what you do now. Your future depends on what you are doing right now. So think about your future self, friend. What will happen if my dreams are not fulfilled? And come out of your comfort zone and start working hard. Point number five. Take a challenge to change yourself. A study was done in which it was said that taking a challenge is the most effective way to change yourself. Take a challenge for the next 30 days or six months. Make a hard schedule in which there is no room for comfort. Make a goal for the next six months that I will do these things every day and work hard for this many hours. Whatever your challenge is, write it down and put it on your wall and look at it every day. Read it and tell yourself that if I don't work hard today, 
my dreams will never be fulfilled. Get up the next day, look at that chart, read it and tell yourself again that if I don't work hard today, then I will probably never reach there. If you work like this for the next six months, then time can never be wasted, my brother. Point number six, understand your value, my brother. You will never waste time. Think what do you want your value to be in the coming time? How much should your income be? Your earning? Let's take eight locks for a month. That your goal is to earn eight locks in a month. According to this, one day's value is 8,000 and one hour's value is 1,000. Stick it in your room that the value of my one day is 8,000 and the value of one hour is 1,000. Now think that if one hour is wasted, it means a loss of 1,000. The person for whom every minute is valuable, every hour's value is 1,000. He cannot sit comfortably. If you think like this, then time can never be wasted. If you don't think like this, then you can never become that person with 2.5 likes. My brother, we think that one day we will suddenly become successful, but it is not so. Every day we have to think like successful people, feel like successful people, work hard like successful people, manage time, then only a successful person is born. So understand the value of your time, my brother. If I am giving one hour to someone, then I am giving 1,000 to that person. This is the value of your time. Fit this thing in your mind. Point number seven, stay alone or change your surroundings. You cannot change the people around you, but you can change who will be around you. Keep such people with you. Make friends who work all the time, are hardworking, who have a big vision. Stay with such people who discuss ideas, vision, goals, and not with other people. If you have such friends, then you can never live a life. In such surroundings, your mindset will change or you do not get such people. So stay alone. If you stay alone, time can never be wasted. YouTube Zero Practical Ways I read as many biographies as I could, read books, studied successful people, watched podcasts of successful people. From the gist of all of them, seven practical ways that will make you ten times more productive. Point number one, the most effective way. This way can change your whole life. Set a deadline, set a deadline that I have to edit this video by 5 p.m. today. I decided in the morning. Now whatever happens, I will definitely edit that video by 5 p.m. If you don't set a deadline, if you don't create urgency, then you will keep postponing that work, thinking that I will do it later. A friend will call saying, come play. Then you will think that friend, I will edit the video at night. I will go to play now. At night you will say, friend, I am feeling sleepy. I will edit the video in the morning. Think the work that could have been finished by 5 p.m. or the video that could have been edited by 5 p.m. or was going to be done. Now it has been postponed to the next day when, if we... When you set such a deadline, you immediately set fire to all those excuses that were stopping you. This single method can change your whole life. Point number two, 60 minutes rule. Master the 60 minutes in the morning. In the first 60 minutes of the morning, work on that task, which is going to bring 100% result in your life, which is the most important task. It is said that in the morning, work on that task. 60 minutes can make or break your career. So you have to decide whether you want to spend the first 60 minutes of the morning scrolling, sleeping, or focusing on your most important task. Highly successful people work on their most important tasks for 60 minutes in the morning. These 60 minutes of the morning are so important that thousands of books have been written on it. Point number three is time blocking. Divide your whole day as to what you have to do and when. Like, I have to study in the morning, work out, run, work on my main project in the afternoon, rest for an hour in the day, play with friends in the evening or go to the gym. Divide your whole day as per your convenience. This method works like a to-do list or is its advanced version. Point number four, make a list and write in it what I do not want to do in the whole day. If it is clear, then all distractions will be removed. Write things in the list as per your convenience. Like, I will not use the phone in the morning, I will not waste two hours watching movies. I will not play games. I will not use the phone for more than one hour in the whole day. Whenever you go to do these things, it will click in your mind that no, you should not do these things. Whatever things distract you, stop you. Make a list of all those things that I do not want to do these things. 
Point number five, 10 hour rule. According to this rule, if you give 100 hours of a year to any discipline, then you become better than 90% people in that discipline. 100 hours of a year, which is only 20 minutes of a day, so fix 20 minutes daily for those things which are going to bring 100% result in your life. It can be reading for someone. It can be yoga or workout or any skill. Start winning your day by making daily goals of 20, 25 minutes like this. Point number six, review the whole day. Sit at night and review the whole day that how much of the to-do list that I had made has been followed, which things you need to correct, which thing was stopping you, Keeping all these things in mind, the to-do list of the next day is ready. Do point number seven, work on your health. Today's generation is the most unhealthy. There's lack of energy, sleeping late at night and then sleeping till 10 a.m., eating more than required, not working out, not going to the toilet on time. 70% unhealthy food in your diet like junk food, fast food, bakery products, porn, Today's young generation wastes at least four to five hours a day on smartphones, social media, gaming, and videos. All these things drain the energy of the body and increase laziness. That is why motivation is always missing. The mind remains tired and one does not feel like working. First of all, work on these bad habits of yours and work on your health. People run after managing time, but they do not understand what will you do with time when there is no energy. Friends, in the end, I will only say that there can be many reasons for wasting time. It may be that you are afraid of working, fear of failure. It may be that you are waiting to be perfect. It may be that you have given up inside that my dreams will not be fulfilled. Or it may be that you do not have any goal. Time. There can be many reasons for wasting time, but now pick up a pen and paper and start writing. Ask yourself, what are the things that are stopping you? When the reasons are in front of you, then you can find the solution yourself. Managing time is not a big task. The only condition is that you should be ready to work all the time. If you are not ready, then no matter what anyone says, there will never be any improvement. Friends, there is a simple way to manage time. Make your daily goals keeping your long-term goal in mind. Write down the most important ones. Keep those tasks in your priority list that are going to bring 100% result. It doesn't matter if you miss someone's call. Scrolling all day is fine, but your daily goals should not be missed. After some time, when you see your friends building a house, buying a new car, then you will get angry at yourself. There is a very powerful line by Paulo Coelho that a day will come when you will wake up and see that your dreams are not going to be fulfilled now. The life you wanted to live the dreams you had seen will now remain just dreams, because now you have no time left. You have wasted the time that you had, so get up now and start working.